Hello everybody and welcome back to, well, a new series of The Long Dark. I know that uh, it may not be the, you know, biggest uh, series on the channel, but they have came out with, what, Volume 3 of the new P, uh, P, paid DLC. Uh, so, I think it's like 20 bucks or something like that for the uh, DLC. And they came out with a lot of stuff. So if we want to take a look over here. So we can find acorns now. Uh, let's see. What else can we do? Um, <clears throat> arrowhead. Uh, they've made new arrowheads. It's a fire, uh, fire hardened arrow right there. So we need stick, crow feathers, and fire. Right? So 100 times better than that. Um, you know, of course, we have new fishing lures. Um, uh, wow. Look at that. A lot more uh, shell casing. Okay. Acorn. Hmm. Interesting. Wires. Never haven't found wires yet. Okay. It's, so that's interesting. And then, of course, you can make those uh, tip-ups. That's going to be interesting to do as well. Uh, you can actually um, set them anywhere. You don't have to be inside the, uh, the deal anymore. Improvise. Oh, wow. That is new. I did not see those either. Um, improvised... Okay, so I think, yeah, so ptarmigan um, is a new bird that they added. They haven't added the cougar or nothing like that yet. Uh, improvised um, insulation, that should help uh, with heat. Uh, what else did they have here? Uh, of course, acorns, uh, birch bark, burdock. Burdock is a tree that they added. Uh, what else? Oh, and then, of course, we have uh, some broths, uh, ptarmigan, and water, okay, 51 ounces, that's quite a bit. Uh, running river oats, I don't know what that is. It's kind of interesting. And then uh, I also know that they have some more uh, things that they can, um, uh, new uh, items and stuff like that that they've added. So they've, they've done a lot of work to it. And of course, it's been a, a little bit since we've played, so I wanted to get in here and uh, just see how it is. We are playing on... Um, Voyager, I think. So nothing too terribly difficult. Just to see that, uh, you know, we can go out and uh, find some stuff and, and, you know, try to last as long as possible. And uh, go from there. So hopefully you guys are going to enjoy this series, hopefully. And uh, we will go from there. Let's see. So let's put those on. We can actually... Well, actually, we might as well pick those up because we can actually use that for leather just thought about that. Normally we don't have to worry about it, but now if we want to build some things, we're going to have to worry about it. So we are in Coastal Highway. That is a uh, fantastic place. Uh, it's probably, I would say probably one of the more favorites um, of mine, uh, just because I almost know where everything is. Um, there should be a bear and a moose somewhere around here, and uh, you know there's a lot of moose uh, and stuff, like, or you know, a lot of rabbits and stuff out here. Um, so it should, uh, should be a fairly decent, um, adventure, uh, around here. Now, what I do want to find is we do have an, a hatchet. Yes, we do. It's right there. Now, I do want to find birch, uh, birch bark as fast as humanly possible so we can get some of that, uh, fire-hardened arrows and stuff, uh, rounded up. Uh, that would be pretty fun. I do know where some of them spawn, uh, so we can, you know, try to do that. It's absolutely fantastic that they have added a uh, lower level, um, <coughs> uh, you know, bow and arrow uh, instead of trying to find the heavy uh, hammer and stuff like that. And of course, that would be taking care of the uh, the ptarmigan, um, the uh, what, the, the rabbits, and I'm not sure if they added squirrels or not. I don't know if I'm just if I heard that, or if something else has changed, and then they may be adding that. I'm, I'm not sure, so don't quote me on that. But I do know that there should be acorn trees, or what is it? Is it cedar trees? Oak trees? Should be something around, so it'll be interesting to see. And of course I gotta sneeze again. Good lord, it's uh, allergy season. As always, it's always allergy season, it seems. And uh, as soon as one is over, they start haying, and then it gets even worse, and then they get done, and then it gets worse. So it just seems like it's always worse, but oh well. 
can't complain too much about it. We just got to move on and uh, keep on moving on. Eh, it's raw. We can cook it back at least 50%. And then they also added a, uh, a skillet. So there used to be a pan, and now they actually added a skillet. So what is that? 45. I'm going to pass on that just because I uh, have died a lot from uh, food poisoning from them. Now, I think if you get your cooking skill up, you can eat basically anything. But until then, uh, we're not going to risk our luck here. There's soda there underneath the chair, so we'll grab that. What is this? Oh, that is nothing. All right, let's add some or check these. Now, if this is kind of your, your deal, it is the long dark. And uh, it, like I said, it's an absolute fantastic game, especially to play. Uh, I watched... Um, Bay Area Bugs play it way back in the day uh, when he actually did play it and I, ever since I wanted to play it. So once I got a computer, I got this game and been playing it pretty much ever since. Um, maybe not as religiously as I was, but, uh, you know, pretty pretty often anyway. Oh, look at that. We missed that stuff because we didn't get look. Well, we looked, but we didn't look good enough. Here, let's see. Oh, there's some newspaper we didn't grab. But yeah, if you, if you you know, have a uh, PS4, I think it's PS5, and I think I, they may have came out with the Switch. I'm not 100% sure on that. I know they've been having some problems, but you could pick it up. And of course, like I said, there is a DLC. It's the first uh, DLC that they've ever had, and it came out in like, tw this game came out in like 2014, so it's been quite a while uh, that they've been having some free updates and everything else like that. So... Um, I don't think it's too bad, and uh, they're supposed to be adding um, a cougar eventually, and they should be adding um, a few other things. And, uh, I mean, it's just, it, it's a fantastic game. It really is. Now, on the coastal highway, uh, as if you watch the channel, as uh, a lot of people uh, will see, I try to stay at one place, um, in, in one place in particular, and that is just because... Um, I, I just like it, I guess. Uh, and that's the Quinset um, gas station, I think it is. I think that's what it's called. So that is where we are headed. We're pretty much on the um, far... Well, because we don't have much of a compass or anything, we're pretty much on the far right side of the map here. Uh, and the gas station is right probably behind that rock in between the two pylons. Or pylon pylons, pylings, whatever, stacks, whatever you want to call it. So that is where we're headed, just because, like I said, that's pretty much a, it's it's one of the more ideal places to go. It has a, has a workbench, and has, uh, you know, a good fireplace, has a lot of storage room, uh, and stuff like that. So that is where we're going to go. This guy didn't make it very far. It's kind of weird that, uh, oh, look at that. It's kind of weird that you uh, no, died inside, you know, uh, who knows. Uh, we already have a flashlight, so I'm not real worried about that. The flashlight you can use um, during the Aurora, or the Northern Lights, if you're not familiar what Aurora is. Uh, let's see. Oh, and they also added, I think, like two or three more flashlights, and they also added um, new variations of pistol. Uh, hand, uh, well, a pistol, pistol, I was going to say handheld pistol, well, you know, you can only hold it by your hand, so anyway, uh, so they added some pistols, and then more variants of, uh, different colors and whatnot of the rifle. So, you have a rifle, um, a pistol, and then you have, of course, the bow. So, uh, you know, that's always useful. Of course, that island there, I think, is it that, I think that one has the house... That one may have a house. I'm not 1,000% sure. But what we're going to do is we're just going to shortcut it here. Unless it gets foggy and then we're kind of screwed. But it'll be okay. Everything's looking good. Our temperature's going down. But that's always uh, what's going to happen. Especially during this early stages. Now there is a uh, mine right back there. But we're going to pass it. Because I think that is the um, Aurora... Um, Aurora mine or something like that, and you only can get in if you have the Aurora. 
But if you go in there and the Aurora stops, then you're dead. So it's kind of a risk to do. Here, let's see. What can we do? Yeah, so you can ice fishing hole a anywhere you want. How, how long does that does that take? Eh, well, I don't really want to do it right now, but um, it, it's just interesting that they, they added that. I didn't know they were going to add that, so that's actually a very nice touch. Um, it's always nicer if you have shelter, of course. Um, but uh, if you had the tip up, one would think, if you had the tip up, you can hide inside the shelter, have a fire or whatever, and then run outside if the you know tip up goes off or whatever. Or you could just fish in here, you know, either one. Uh, let's see, mittens. I don't believe we have any mittens, so that's a nice touch there. Let's see, reclaimed wood, nothing up here. Got some fishing line. Got some hook, or uh, a snack anyway, not hooks, but snack. Uh, hooks, what is this? 31%, not going to take it. Wasting a lot of food here, but like I said, that's the first way to get bad juju. Bad juju indeed. So we're just going to skip that. Now, this right there should be where the gas station is, if I remember correctly. It's kind of weird that we're not seeing any wolves or anything. There should be wolves and deer out here. Oh, they're probably all right there. I know there's a few on the horizon just below the white part. And uh, there's a few black dots over there. Now, there should be, like I said, there should be a bear and a moose on this uh, this region as well. Uh, pretty much, if you mess with them, you want to have some firepower. If you don't and you get attacked, you might die. You, you, you got a big, big chance of dying. Uh, the bears, they take pretty much about 90% of your health, and that's if you're full health. Uh, you do have a chance to survive, I think, but you better know what you're doing, and you better be very quick at doing it, is all I'm going to say. But uh, anyway, with that being said, normally the first episode is pretty much just real laid back, chill it, chillin', chilled, chilly, whatever, uh, and, and the reason is, is that, you know, you're just trying to find everything you can, you're just trying to, uh, take your time and, and find everything, especially if you're new at the game, um, I'm not exactly sure if they've moved things, so it's, um, for, like, people that's playing a long time, they can't just go to the same spots over and over and over again, oh, no, I didn't want to do that, and, uh, so I think they've moved some things and stuff like that. So you have to look for different things. Nothing in there, of course. Never is. Uh, some more pork and beans. Some peanut butter. That's always useful. I wonder who owns this stuff. Nobody cares. You know why no one cares? Because no one's here. So that's another thing. If you have never heard of this game, it is 100% you and you only. That is it. There is nobody else out there uh, to help you out or anything. So, it's all you, 100% alone. Now, there is like a mod or something that you can play multiplayer with. Uh, I haven't tried it, and I've only seen like one episode on it, um, but mm, I don't know if I would want to do that. I mean, because this game is basically, you know, you're alone, you're trying to survive. But, uh, I don't know. Maybe I'll have to look into the um, the two player and and or multiplayer mod or whatever and, and see, you know, what happens. Um, like I said, maybe I can get my wife on here, uh, hang out with her a little bit, and uh, you know, go from there. But of course, you know, trying to get her on the the PC or play any games or what have you is uh, sometimes challenging. So I'm gonna have to uh, go from there. But anyway, like I said, let's get some more water. You can never have too much water. Because, uh, I mean, really food is the problem. But water I'm not sure I can carry much more. could be a problem. What? You're 70 pounds, dog. You're, you're okay, dude. Okay? I promise you that you will love it when you, you know, are fine. So we're going to pick up all the boots and stuff. Like I said, uh, pretty much we are over-encumbered. So he's going to be complaining a little bit. Um, but once we get home, or, well, to the home that we're going to, I should say, um, we can just start stockpiling everything, just making sure we got all of those, all of these, 
Uh, we should have gotten all of that. Okay, let's go. We'll go out the back door. Why not? We went out or went in the front door, so we'll be fine. Okay, so the thingamajigger's right over here. Right there's the gas station. This is basically where the bear likes to hide out and, and right up that road there. Doesn't look like there's a road, but there is. And uh, there's a lot of firewood here, a lot of pallets and stuff. You can, you know, all of those. And I was actually here one one time I was playing, and I was even going to other houses and, and cutting down all the um, chairs and tables and everything else just because, you know, it was there. So, uh, let's see. We don't have any lights or nothing, so that kind of sucks. The lantern fuel, I'm actually going to leave it there. Um, and then, of course, you know, we can have a... Uh, what is it? Oh, old mill flour. Really so this is something new. And I've never seen it before. So that's all oh, cooking oil. Uh, 68%. Not sure how long it goes. Good old maple syrup since we are in Canada. Do I have any source of uh, lantern? No. Well, that sucks. And of course it's getting dark. Oh, oh my goodness, there's a pistol. Man, how lucky are we? Got a pistol. That's the normal pistol that we've had. Good old casings. Oh, we got at least one shell in it. Or can put one shell, so that's always nice. Of course, we're going to get some cash. Never mind. Normally, you get some cash. What time is it? Oh, it's getting real dark. Okay, recycled can. Is there any sort of... Normally, there's something. Uh, what car? Oh, okay. Don't have a pry bar. That sucks. Can you give me some sort of lantern? That would be nice, because I can use matches, but I don't want to... What is this? Wires. Well, I'm going to leave that there. Oh, what was this? A replacement fuse. Wait a minute. Huh. Okay. So that's kind of interesting. Maybe we'll have to go to the new region. Oh. Okay. So I found two of them. Kind of interesting. Uh, so we'll have to take that to the new dealio. Uh, the new dealio is uh, the Forsaken Airfield. Um, I can't necessarily remember how to get there. Because it's been so long. Oh, hey, look. A storm lantern. That's what I was looking for. What is this? Wow. Man, we are just finding all sorts of things. Can we actually find something? Or you, like, get something? There we go. Get some light in this thing. There we go. Okay. What is this? A note left behind. We'll read that later if we feel like it. Okay. More fuses. More everything. More wires. Apparently, they really want you to get the wire thing down. Okay, so we'll just have to wait and see. I'm actually really interesting or interested to go fishing and whatnot um, because, uh, you know, I've never been able to uh, put it anywhere, right? So this is all new. This is basically the first thing you see when a new update comes out. I haven't played. I just found out that it came out, you know, uh, the other day. I think I was working. I was like, oh, hey, it came out. So I watched the video and uh, stuff like that. But anyway, I'm not going to keep you guys too terribly long just because uh, I don't really have a game plan for this episode, which is normal because I never have any game plans for these episodes. Look at that. New pants. I don't have a prime bar, so that kind of sucks. And then what we need to do is we need to start um, sorting things and everything else. That's a shell casing. Oh, another shell casing. Apparently these people didn't really care for picking up after themselves. Gee whiz. Anyway, like I said, uh, this is where we're going to end it. We made it to the gas station. And uh, hopefully we can start cooking something. Uh, I'm not sure if you need uh, the skillet to cook things or if you need recipes or not. But uh, I think in the next episode we will try to figure all that out. So as always, thank you for liking, commenting, and subscribing. I'll catch you all in the next one. And you all, take care.